Hello everyone, I'm Sarah. Welcome to 1213 Prescott Way. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified when we post another video. A video. A video. Oh, 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 video. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode. Hello everybody, I have, I made a salmon casserole with some fresh salmon wild caught and it is so delicious. I made it last night, well yesterday evening for dinner and I am having it for lunch today. Mm. Let's go ahead and get a thumbnail in. Mm. I don't know why I do that after I take a bite, and so I'm trying to smile and not chew. So let me. Oh no! Can you see the salmon in there? I'm also doing a video. Showing how I made it. See, there's this there's one piece of salmon right there. I cut them into big chunks like that. And I added some broccoli, um, cauliflower, and carrots. Mm -hmm. Made cornbread for David, but I didn't want cornbread. So look what I have some big cheese puffs. Put it on the side right there. Yeah, you can see it. You can see it. Hmm. I couldn't wait for lunchtime. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm. I'm hungry. So, how was you guys' Labor Day weekend? I had a great time partying and resting in between. Friday went to, ooh, sorry, I forgot to turn off the heater. Ooh. Friday went to David's show. Rested Saturday. And then Sunday went to David's show. And um and then we went to karaoke. Seemed like we went Friday too. We did. <laughs> We went to karaoke Friday after David's show and Sunday. There was this one girl. You could tell she had too much to drink. She came over to David and I. Asked David if he was Brendan. 
David said no. Then she came back and asked me if I was Brendan. And then she kept getting on stage while people were singing. And one guy, she just snatched a microphone and started singing. He was so good about it. He's an entertainer as well, so. I guess that's where his patients come in. Ooh. And then three ladies were singing. She got on the stage in front of them. They asked them. Um, when her and the gentleman she was with went to leave, we were on our way out the door as well. Um, they're both drunk. We thought it was just her, but he was drunk too. I mean, and he looked more plastered than she was, if that's possible. And so Gary, one of the guys that sings with David, he was on the balcony and the stairs, we were going down the balconies above it, you know, to the side. And so he saw them leaving and he was told us bye and told them bye. And he was like, man, are you sure you can drive? He said, I'll drive you because you're drunk. And the guy said, F you. So we knew he was drunk. I just hope they made it home safely. I don't know who they are. Sunday night. <laughs> Sunday night's karaoke it was at a different place. I'd never been there before. It was a lot, I won't say a lot bigger. It seemed bigger, more spacious. Sunday, I sang. Well, I sang both nights. I did back up for Deborah and her song Friday. And then Sunday, I sang Girls Just Want to Have Fun by Cindy Lauper. Horrible. <laughs> I could hear it back. I'm like, ew. Um, it's funny. You always have to be prepared for, you know, when, when you go to karaoke. And now I understand because I remember when we used to do it in Vegas. Although David is a singer, I just thought he would have songs at the top of his head that he'd want to sing. But he'd always say, what should I sing? And so we're brainstorming. And I get it now because now that I started doing it, I'm like, hmm. And even though you hear songs on the radio, because David, both of us, would he'd, he'd say, ooh, you should sing that song. And I'm like, yeah. Then you think you're going to remember. But as soon as it comes down time to it, you're like, oh, what should I sing? What should I sing? And then you come up with this dumb song. Actually, the song's not dumb. It just doesn't fit you. Because it's the only thing you could think of. <laughs> so next time I'm going to have my list when I'm listening to the radio. That's what I thought I was doing. But I'm going to put it in where I could have easy access to it. Because this karaoke thing is getting serious. <laughs> So, but we had a good time, very good time. And then relaxed yesterday, which was Monday. Well, I didn't relax, relax. I did things around the house and, um, you know, picked up here and there. And then I cooked this meal and breakfast for David. I don't know, I don't know what I had for breakfast. I don't even remember. Even though, because I really don't eat breakfast, it wasn't breakfast foods, because I don't eat that, but it was, I think I, probably, probably because I ate at, after 12, it was probably like more like one-ish, something like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed your weekend, because I know I did come back today, which is Tuesday, and then next Friday, I have a surprise for you guys. We're going to have a blast.
we are going somewhere couples retreat i guess i'm saying it couples retreat and there are three couples so it's thruples <laughs> and i've always wanted to do this so this is going to be a blast and i cannot wait we've been counting down the days and just we just know it's going to be a blast so I will keep you guys updated. Hopefully they don't mind me recording or I will just be recording David and I and trying to get it in here and there. But I do plan on recording some aspects of our stay just so you guys can see how much fun we're having. Just games and just fun surprises and just doing all kinds of stuff. You know, barbecuing and we're doing fr we're going to be there from Friday until Monday. So I cannot wait. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Because we talk about it all the time. And then I, I plan on meeting my son in October. I know this month is his birthday month, so he's gonna go to visit his girlfriend. But so I told him in October I want to fly to Houston, meet him there, and stay the weekend. Because I haven't been, you know, to see him in, in, since he's moved to Texas. So I'd like to go visit him. They like they came, you know, both of my sons. They were here in, for Thanksgiving last year. So that was a great treat. But now I want to go see him. And I think that'll be a great time as well. And what else? I think that's the updates. Going back to Vegas in October as well. Um, so, yeah. I wait for the cooler months to do my visiting before it gets, you know, really cold, snow or anything like that. But although I did last year, I just went on days I knew it wasn't snowing, you know, on my way to the airport to go to Vegas. But we'll see. We'll see. And I will keep you updated. We'll see. We'll see. And that is the end of my show. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, video instead of video. So on that note, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified when we post another video, video instead of video. And have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, and night. And I will see you on the next video. Love you. Peace.